Hey guys, Alicia from Love Letter Generation. Hope you're all doing well. I'm on here with a few items that I recently received from Queen of Craft. I've done uh, collaborations with them in the past and um, yeah, I thought I'd do another one. So um, I got to choose a few different um, pretty things from their shop. So I'll just show you what I grabbed. So I ended up grabbing some of these really beautiful charms. So I'll just go in and show you what they look like. So I ended up grabbing some of these pretty sparkly black heart charms. They are so beautiful. Like how gorgeous are they? I just love how they shine. So I can't wait to create something with these. I do have something in mind. They are just so beautiful. So I'll just pop them there. Okay, I also ended up grabbing some um, black spider sequins and I thought these would be perfect for um, Halloween crafting. As you guys can see there, a nice size. So I thought they'd be perfect to add to my Halloween projects. I'm just getting spiders everywhere at the moment. <laughs> um, they also sent just this little um, book, which is just says cherry blossom, and it's just a little notebook. That was just a little, um, just a little gift, a free gift for me, which is really lovely of them. So I'm going to leave all the links down below to everything you see here and um, you'll be seeing some projects very soon using these gorgeous products that I chose. So I ended up grabbing this cute little, um, it's like a little sequin type pack. So let's just see, I've had this card in there, Queen of Craft, thank you for your service. So let's have a look and see what this looks like. I thought this would be really, really fun. Oh, I think they come individual, like little individual capsules. Just trying to get into them. Yep, so they come in little individual containers. Now, I'm sorry if my filming's a little bit different today as well, guys. I had to film somewhere a bit differently because um, there was just too much noise going on in the background. So you get all these little different fun jars. You get some beautiful, like it's almost like that um, iridescent shred. You got some fine glitter. You get some tiny little um, iridescent stars. I just thought these would be really um, cute to include in my shakers. And you get a really good amount in this too. Let me just have a look. So you get this really pretty one it's like really fine um almost like chunky glitter actually i love the colors in that you get some little hearts 
some little flowers and some little stars. I thought these would be really fun um, just to, to include, like I said, into my um, into my shakers. I've got some more here, yeah, I'll show you. So I also have some stars. Um, there's another type of star. So the other one was more a hollow star and this is a um, not a hollow star. <laughs> um, you've got like a sort of hollow heart. This one's got some pretty little, um, oh, they got weird static in them. These have got little, um, like, gems. Hope my camera's focusing. And the same with this one. They're almost like little um, diamond dots, I guess. I don't own diamond dots, but I have a feeling this is sort of what they look like. It's like your little, little diamond, diamondy gem looking pieces that you can stick onto your projects. Gorgeous. So that was the pack I chose for that. Then I also chose a couple of dies. So I, I went with um, this one for Halloween. Really cute. So it's almost like a um, spiderweb banner. And you get two there. So you get a bigger size spiderweb and then a smaller size spiderweb. So I can't wait to try that one out. And then I went and grabbed this um, like movie film strip die and I thought this would be perfect with all the little sequin bits and pieces that I grabbed to turn this into like a sequin shaker embellishment. And I love the movie strips, like the film strip. So I thought that would be cute to play with. And then I grabbed something that I've never tried before, so I hope it works out for me. It's a embossing plate, or an embossing folder as they call it. So I've never tried embossing before, but I saw this one and I saw that it was a gorgeous star pattern. So I really wanted to... Um, to try it out like I said I've never done anything like this before so I'm hoping it will go through my um, Kayser craft die cutting machine because I have an idea to create some really fun embossed Halloween um, sort of style like treat bags using this so really really cute so yeah first time i'm going to be trying this out so wish me luck <laughs> but i just love the star pattern and i wanted to try something new so those are what i chose from queen of craft i'm really happy with these they're such pretty items so um yeah stay tuned guys and um You'll see some videos coming out shortly over the next couple of weeks um, using these gorgeous um, products that I chose. So I'm going to leave all links down below for you guys to go um, find these easily as well as a, um, a coupon code as well. And um, so you guys can get a bit of a discount when you visit their shop. So I'll leave that below. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching, guys, and take care. Bye.